Mr. Reddy, Mr. Gargill, who have given me this opportunity to visit this iconic project called Hyderabad Metro Rail. I have been interacting with Mr. Reddy in the past and since yesterday I am with him. I admire the passion of a, the person for this project. I have never seen this kind of commitment and passion of an individual for a public project. And the same passion flows in his team and in the officials who are working here from LNT side. Metro Rail is not new for me. I fondly recollect that September 98, the first foundation stone earth breaking ceremony was done for the bridge over river Yamuna for Delhi Metro. That work was also with LNT. And in 15 years, we have come the long way from totally government owned metro. This Hyderabad Metro is, has a unique distinction of the first project which does not have going to have any direct or indirect strain on the public funds except 10% viability gap funding. Much more than that, the state will recover due to the development infused on the completion of this metro. Therefore, all the people who are connected with infrastructure creation are keenly watching the outcome of this experiment which is called Hyderabad Metro. I have uh, visited the alignment, the station and the depot and uh, I find that as usual the quality of course is superb wherever it is required and from the safety and the structural point of view it is superb but wherever it is required from aesthetic point of view there also it is superb. That is a unique distinction that the entire structure hopefully will gel very well with the general aesthetics of the city. As is expected from a PPP project. Why would you go for PPP? Because cost optimization and time optimization. And both the things are amply visible in this project. Very optimum use of the right of way and the available land. Very compact layout of the depot and the yard. Modern state of art design and construction technologies, which will certainly become the common practice and practices to be emulated by the other metro rails. This has been a real good exposure for me personally and I must congratulate uh, the his team for uh, this. Mainly uh, we have the role of because there are certain issues of the Hyderabad metro with the railways by way of track crossings and by way of land made, being made available. And the third thing which we have uh, is that for all the metros, technical control is with the Ministry of Railways. So the broad technical parameters like uh, the design standards to be followed, the schedule of dimension and various other safety measures are to be uh, as per the laid down standards by Ministry of Railways and in case there is any deviation it has to be approved by Ministry of Railways. So there may be certain issues uh, with related to that. That also is my objective during this visit and I am confident that uh, there are certain outstanding issues which will, we will resolve uh, shortly.